Okay, we're pretty much getting down to uh, uh, time where I really gotta gotta get done what I need done. Just gonna pick up the trussing blocks. Hmm. I wish I had that a quarter. You know what? I kind of like putting these there. That work. Yeah, you gotta put these. I think I'll use those up there. Let me make some more up. They don't look the best, but in order to not fall in there, I think I could still fall in that gap right there. Yeah, I don't like that. That's not great, but it's going to have to be done. Because whenever this ends like this, you can walk into that, I believe. Uh, maybe not there. This one was different, was it? fall in through there. This is going to hurt. It's got to be tried. Yep. Okay. My cones. This actually oof, I did that wrong. Dang it. I think every one of these are gonna be done different, unfortunately.
I've been putting a solid piece around the outside of all these and I want a row going this way across something There's definitely something coming okay it lands straight on it thing to keep in mind is because of the new, well, I will say new tracking system, the tracking system in this game, that they will, they will tend to go towards the easy spots. So if you're digging out like this area here, it's a good chance that the, they'll attack into this area. So you want to, you want to even up your defenses as much as possible. Um, there's not, well, I, you know, there is a, a guess a theory that you could make the place that you want to defend at a little bit weaker. Maybe they'll come through there. Maybe not, though. I don't think it's 100%, but um, it's just something to keep in mind. I don't I don't think there's any one way of doing this as far as defenses go. I mean, the, the best way to do a defense in this game is just, in my opinion, is tons of spikes. They're cheaper. They're easier to maintain. Um, I also I will be putting up blade traps. I will be putting up all the other stuff as well. But all that stuff will be just kind of secondary, having fun. Uh, ooh, look at how it works, kind of stuff. The the blade the uh, spikes for me will always be the thing that does the the most work. What I'll do is down below, I'll I'll start once I get everything kind of set. I'll start down below and maybe straightening out where what direction every quarter block's going and that kind of deal. Right now they kind of they basically just go wherever. It's there's a little bit of chaos in it, no doubt. Hmm. needs a lot of work too.
I think I'll eventually have spikes running entirely under this thing, but I don't I don't know if it's necessarily an issue. It's definitely not going to be an issue for the 28 Lord, because I'm not going to even think about it being an issue. Um, I think this part is so far out that they don't even care about it. Obviously we haven't finished that. I think I did not finish that because I wanted to do that on video. Uh, I just kind of got the basic layout done. Okay. Alright, so this is going to be the, the part that is kind of... You can't leave a T like that, right? You can't leave a T. You have to fill that. So you got one coming... That would cover it. I think that I think the other way you could do it, you could actually put a quarter block going like that in there, and that would leave a gap of. I don't like that, but that doesn't look good. Um, I'm just going to use these half blocks. I think that looks pretty good for now. Um, if I need to. What I've usually done is I usually use the. Uh, the trussing blocks in these areas because you can shoot through them. But I want to go ahead and use these halves because I just, I just think it, it looks a little bit better. Right here's fine the way that ties in. And Uh, dang it. But wait, that doesn't go all the way out to the edge, does it? That would cover that one. You know what? I like the... I like the half blocks better. I think it, the half blocks look better. I know you can shoot through these, but I think I can manage them. And then then this one is it right? That one also. Yep. And then the quarters run continue to run back. I'm up here. I'm going to go ahead and break out the auger. After the after the day twenty eight horde, uh, 
I'm going to start clearing out these this area down here, clearing out the spikes down there, and I'll start making that my melee battleground. Uh, up to this point, I'm still really have to stay above them. I could go and clear out some of them and do a little bit down there, but it's not really worth my time right now. So. Watch where you're walking. side. Okay, it does. It actually goes out. Same thing on these.
All right, that's the outside. Uh, I do need to still put these. Dang it. Uh, okay, that's not going to work there. Oh, trap. this to be double wide here too. I don't get enough quarter blocks right now to worry about that I suppose. Let me just get all this other stuff straightened. I'm still making them yep. I guess that's why these got the rails going straight to it, so... Okay, I'm gonna have to address the old. I didn't realize that it's. I got the. I got these in here. Come across here. Come across here. Should be a door here. Okay.
Apparently copy that rotation does not work for these. Oh, there we go. Ah! Okay, that's right. <coughs> I should probably go around and maybe go find my nail gun or my uh, yeah my nail gun. Take you, take you. Upstairs too. Nope, no corn. This is not what I suggest you do on, on uh, the night before Horde Night at 1800, pick corn. But I want to get some meat stew made, so I think I'm fine.
the chain. What am I missing? Water. You gotta kid me. <coughs> I want to put enough cement in here to um, be able to patch any holes that pop up. Auger, not going to need you. Probably won't need that. We'll need a hammer. to make these so I got any more arrows below ready to go I think that'll be enough shotgun slugs for me for a while. Uh, what all I need? For? I need feathers, which I don't have. God, I don't know if I'm able to click any more feathers. Okay.
The adventure one is just stuff that I know I'm going to use all the time. It's kind of a weird name, but you know, there's like one box you kind of use as a drop box for stuff that you're going to be uh, having to use. Okay, where my shotgun go? Usually when I do this, what I try to do is I try to only fill the top with stuff. This top uh, area. Medical. in the bike still.
<sighs> yes, I know. This is kind of brutal. I to could cut this out of the video, I suppose, but... start saving those parts. Those are pretty good parts. Okay, it's trader stuff. 